Here's your 41 Action News update. I'm Kevin Holmes with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines. A data breach impacts nearly 12,000 students in the Lee Summit School District. We're told the breach affected an assessment platform, which the district used prior to the 2016 to 2017 school year. Students' names, email addresses, and birthdays were exposed. The district says the platform does not contain social security numbers or any financial information. The hack involved close to 10 years worth of student data. The company behind the platform, Pearson, is offering free credit monitoring services. You can call or email the company. You can also find it on our web, web link section on our website at KSHB.com. A cement truck slams into traffic, tipping over on I-29. A crash blocked off the northbound lanes near Davidson Road for more than three hours. The cement truck also hit a van and a tractor trailer. A driver in serious condition. The man in the van was also hurt, but is recovering tonight. We're told the man had three dogs in his van at the time. They are all okay, but the crash scared one of the dogs away. It took off. The driver immediately took to social media. The post was shared more than a thousand times and someone found that pup. He's back home and safe tonight. Lakeside Speedway back open after months of setbacks, all because of flooding. That track set to open May 31st, but due to flooding in March, May and last month, the track kept pushing back its opening day. Lakeside Speedway will be open through October 4th. Gary Lezak has your forecast. And here it is. Good evening, everyone. We've been having a very active weather pattern. Thunderstorms have hit to the west. They've hit to the east. Not too many in the middle. Next week, there will be more chances. But the good news for this weekend, the chance of rain goes down to near zero. A few clouds, 81 degrees Saturday, 84 degrees Sunday. It is looking fantastic. Remember, you can get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.